guys, it's Jojo here with another video, and today I will be playing more uh, Minecraft Enderman Reborn. It's going to be cool. Um, but yeah, I have a few things planned for today, so I'm hoping that uh, we will get those done. Um, I want to go visit the villagers. I have some stuff to show you guys. I fixed the uh, horse problem over by the outdoor stables, so I will be showing you that. I built a new path. It's it's cool. Also, me and Molly, we did take down what was supposed to be the question mark. Uh, that was actually something from the original Enderman series called The Enderman. It wasn't Reborn, because Reborn is sort of just like a second season, I guess you could say. But the, uh, the question mark was right in this area, and it was never finished. It was kind of like not even it wasn't even halfway done and i was planning to finish it at some point in the future but that never happened it was basically supposed to be the place that i went to do the question of the day for the comment section but i am not interested in doing the uh question of the day uh right now so we might have a question mark in the future but not right now so i just didn't want to have a half built ex exclamation point looking thing uh, sitting back there. So, that is what we did there. Alright, so I'm going to press this button and see what number I get. Um, and I got four. Again! Wow! I just, like, I don't even know how that's happening, because usually I only get one, but... Anyways, gonna press this button four times. One, two, three, four. Alright, so it looks like we just got two oxide daisies and two slime blocks. I need to clean out this, uh this chest uh, sometime in in the future, but anyways, there's a spawn horse thing in there. Weird. Um, let's go quick visit the villagers. Um, I'm not really sure if we're gonna trade with them or not. I don't really have very many items that, like, can be used for trading with villagers, but I will see you guys there. And here we are, right in the village. I should sometime put some floor in here. I should do that sometime. We've got this nice little house right here with a nice crafting table in it. Some chairs, tables. Nice, nice. Um, the villagers, they look like they're doing pretty good. There's pretty much no way for a zombie to get, like, in the village just because... Like, how would they do that? And there's, like, kind of a moat sort of looking thing, like, around the village. If I climb on the wall here, you can see it, um, right there. That spider can get me, though. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, so spiders can get in here. Spiders are kind of a problem. Um, you can see there's, like, a really deep pit that the zombies can fall into and die. Um, they, sometimes they live just because it's not a very like deep sort of moat thing, but they can't, I, I don't think they can get out. They might be able to, nope. Uh, they actually can't get out through this side. They can only get out through the other side. So yes, that is something. There is a cave right there, cool. Um, but yes, so you can actually see the zombies. They cannot escape that unless they come all the way around and um, get out through there. And even then, they are not able to get in the village. Um, yes, spiders are a problem, I would say. Spiders are a problem. Oh no, oh no. Okay. Whoa, whoa. I don't know where, but I'm being shot at by a skeleton somehow. Um... I thought I put torches on the roofs. I don't even think skeletons can spawn on the roof, but we will just have to be careful when we're in this area. Also, somebody asked me why I'm eating bread and not pumpkin pie. We actually don't have very much pumpkin pie left. I kind of tried to make a wall here, but it didn't really work very well. Like, it's not very a very efficient wall. But, I mean, it keeps them out to an extent. If they were to come around, then they can get me, but I mean, not every place in, on here is going to be safe. This area is relatively safe. Not really, because I haven't put very many torches up on that platform, and they can get down. 
I'm pretty sure I have found monsters in uh, Clover's house before. So I'm just going to help her out here and put some torches up in here so that she doesn't have to worry about uh, monsters in her house. Whee! I always feel kind of bad after doing that on purpose, just because, like, my my poor armor. Like, I don't really have the best armor there is. I don't really want to make diamond armor, because I feel like that's kind of a waste of diamonds that I could be using for tools. Get some of these cocoa beans here. I never really make cookies, but I really should make cookies more in Minecraft. I feel like people underestimate the power of cookies. And there we go! It's a nice, fresh, harvested... Uh, cocoa bean area. Uh, I am going to go visit the horses now um, in the outdoor stables. The horses that Molly spawned, um, they are safe and sound in the outdoor stables now. It's funny to look back on, but not really the funniest thing in the moment. And now I have all of these horses that don't have any, that don't have homes. Um, like, all of these horses are the ones that she spawned. And there's more on the other side. Also, the fences, I changed them from spruce wood to dark oak wood and the gates, too. Just to give this place a little bit more color. Um, and I want to change the fences inside the building at some point and out here to dark oak. Just to give it some color. I really think it looks good. But, um, yeah, these horses were spawned by Molly, too. And uh, I'm not really sure what I'm going to do with them. I do want to use this grassy area. I, I kind of want to use it as a little pasture. But I think I want to wait until this is cleared out. And I can connect it with that pasture. So that we can just have a really big, uh, really cool pasture. And just not really have to worry about our horses. This pasture is actually really small in my opinion. Um just because I feel like we can only fit like a max of maybe five or six horses in here without it looking crowded. I know that I actually am going to make it so that this is the same level as this at some point. So like these levels, you don't need these stairs. It's all just one big level. But that probably will not be for a while. Um, because it's kind, it's kind of a tedious project. I would have to take out like the torches and all of the signs and the hay and it would just take a long time and the fence. Like I would just, it would take a long time. We are actually starting to run out of coal. We have that stack and this almost stack. So we have less than two stacks left of coal and that's all our coal, like all of it. Um, so I might actually have to make a mining episode with Molly to go on like a coal adventure because we are gonna need some soon. I don't want to make charcoal because I feel like that's a waste of like trees. I feel like a lot of our coal also has to go to torches so I don't know what we're gonna do about that because that means that we won't have torches for a while. Luckily I tend to keep quite a few torches on me and there may be more in the tool chest but I mean, distributed throughout everybody that plays on the server, that's not very much. I might have to ask um, Clover or, or uh, Minecraft Lover if they have any torches that we could, like, just pretty much put into one chest for everybody to share. Um, Muppet Master might have some, but I wouldn't ask her because she's kind of a beginner, so she needs as many, as many resources as she can get. Somebody asked me what this is. It actually makes the weather stay, um, like, normal so that it will never have severe thunderstorms because lightning can actually set things on fire. It did that once in River's Way, and it was, it was a bad, bad moment. So we keep this here to keep everyone safe and everyone's buildings safe because most of the stuff in this world is made out of wood and flammable objects, so I just have decided to... Um, keep the weather just sunny and bright all the time. Anyways, guys, I think I'm gonna end this episode here. I hope you enjoyed. Thank you so much for watching. Please hit that button, subscribe, make a pineapple. Very happy if you didn't already, and all that other fun stuff. Bye, guys. Jojo out.